Believe it or not, when Wanderlust began over 25 years ago, our founder travelled around South America for several months with hand luggage only. And if you know what to look for in the bag that you buy, you too can go cabin only approved. The first thing to consider is size. With airlines, not mentioning any Irish carriers in particular, increasing and decreasing the allowances all the time, you've got to stay up to date and know which will fit, pardon the pun, in the overhead locker or under the seat in front of you. This information can be found on any of the labels on the luggage or on the websites of the manufacturers of the luggage you're interested in buying. The next thing to consider is the unpacked weight of your cabin baggage. When you're flying in economy, you're normally restricted to between seven and 10 kilograms. So remember, every kilogram your luggage weighs before you put anything in it is one less kilogram of belongings that you can take with you. Explore the luggage that you're considering buying. Are there pockets on the outside? Inside, is there some organisational pockets or vented sections that you can keep dirty or wet clothes in? All these organisational extras can really help when travelling, especially if they have a padded pocket, for instance, for carrying a tablet or a laptop. Just remember though, all these extras come with extra weight, which again decreases all the things you can take on board the plane with you. Every luggage brand out there vies for your attention with hidden features and added extra. These can range from a number of things, such as combi locks that are built in or expandable capacity. But before you part with your hard-earned cash, ask yourself, do you really need them? Every luggage will of course have handles, but these come in two types, single telescopic or double telescopic. Now the single takes up less room inside the case, which means more capacity for your belongings. However, these can be harder to manoeuvre. A double telescopic handle takes up a bit more room inside, but make it much easier to move around. So the choice is yours. Either way, make sure your luggage has grab handles. These are found on the outside of the case and make picking it up and hauling it off the luggage carousel at the airport that much easier. Most cabin bags will now come with wheels. Four is easy to manoeuvre, but adds weight. Two means less stability, but of course, lighter. There's always a compromise. There's lots of advantages to going hand luggage only. You can check in later for your flight. When you arrive, you don't have to wait around for your belongings at the carousel. And of course, you're not weighed down by lots of belongings that you might not even need. So on your next trip, consider taking just one bag with you in the cabin, and that way the adventure can begin as soon as you touch down.